welcome back, I'm the Gaming Beaver, and this- Oh, oh god, what am I doing? I've started it wrong! Ah! Hello and welcome back, I'm the Gaming Beaver, and I'm gonna take those uh, thousand crops. This time we're doing it good, and unfortunately it's this one. No, this is the creature I've already got, I was hoping it was gonna be the Titan Bow. Apparently the Titan Bow is gonna come in November, and unfortunately I'm away for the most of November, so even though you guys will comment it, I'm gonna have to scroll through like hundreds of comments and go, Gaby Beaver, the Titan Bow is out, and I'm just gonna sit there and cry. <laughs> So we're just quickly going in here. Let's see if we can bulk up any creatures before we head straight into the tournament. And look at that, he's taking a nap. It's time to wake up, buddy. The call to action has arose. Um, save two. You know it's gonna be loud, so hold on a minute, guys! And I think that has reimbursed me for the uh, nose to ceratops of evolutions right there. So, okay, uh, I am still saving for the, uh, uh, what do you call it, the, the Titan Boa. That's what I just said what I was saving for. So, um, uh, to look for any gold, I mean these are all gold, macaroni's gold. Um, herbivores, I'm not bothered about which one I level up, um, but it looks like macaroni. Could be a good a good creature to level up, so we're gonna do that. Um, Ambler Amblodon, which is the one that's just actually look at that. He's got slightly less health and um, slightly less damage, so Macaroni is gonna be better than Tusks over there. So um, let's level up Macaroni. Come on, Macaroni, you can do it. Ah. Oh. Almost level 30, almost ready to evolve, but look at that. He's went up basically 1,700 health and an extra 500 attack. So he's definitely in the in the odds to be used this time around. Um, uh, this guy, little Pucci guy, this these have like one of the coolest animations I've seen. Uh, apart from the dodo, they are really cool. But if you're a dog fan, these little guys are the ones for you. Why? This, you see this one here? This little top one? Watch him. When he starts moving, here we go, ready? He's like, he's sniffing around, and then he gets a smell, and he's like, wait, what's that? Wait, what's that? And he digs, and then he's like, and he digs more, he's like, I want it, I want it, I want it. It's beautiful, it's a lovely little bit of animation there. One that you would probably overlook unless you were just looking at them. So, uh, Sabretooth Cat, we haven't used him, he hasn't been in, uh, like properly, neither is Megalania. The Megalania. I'm the Death Panda. Well, it's gonna be one tournament this episode, so we're gonna jump straight in. And guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna bring in those. I don't. I mean, it wasn't 24 hours since I did the Glacier tournament, so we're probably gonna have to buy some back. But let's jump straight, straight in. And uh, Clen, Kellen, Kellenken, Kellenken, Klunkendolk. Uh. That's cool. I never start at the top, I usually start at the bottom. Right, okay, where did Macaroni go? Look at that! She got straight up past Pelter, Fat, Pelter, whatever. Um, so the ones that are, you know what? No, I don't want to buy back all of them. We need to use the Sabretooth Cat, he needs using. Using and abusing. Um, oh god, it's tricky. It really is. He's gonna need backup. You think that's good? We are in silver, so... Oh, thank god. That is almost, if not, a fully leveled up um, Indracotherium, so... We could be in trouble here, because as long as one creature has the majority of your opponent's... Um, like, ferocity, it's gonna be trouble. Uh, oh god, what do you do? You bite an elephant, don't you? You bite it! Buy it, Sabretooth Cat! Oh, it didn't do as much as I wanted to, to do. It looks like a fully leveled up Am Ambulodon. Am Ambul it is Ambulodon. Is, uh, is better than a Sabretooth Cat or a Smilodon. Oh, God! Come on, shake it off. Shake it off, buddy. You've got it, Whiskers. Come on. What's your special like? 
Oh, he's on the prowl. With a burst of speed, there it is! That was the Oh, that was amazing. I kinda I kinda want to block. I want this guy to be the Oh, I wasted him! Oh Jesus! This thing's huge! He needs his pack. He really needs his pack. Um Switch! Switch! He needs backup! And here it is! Here's the backup, my own Ambladon! Oh god! He could probably take another one, but he's gonna struggle to his feet for the blow like that! Uh, let's taunt! I'm gonna bite you! All these guys' weaknesses are bite, so we can at least take that. What, are, are, you, are you saying take that to your own creature? That's horrible! Come on! Oh, he survives, that's right! This is the meat shield tactic in work here. We can just absorb some blows while slowly chipping away their health. Yes, he hasn't used any any specials or blocks yet. Um, the thing is, we are in silver now. When we get to gold, we've, we've got to worry about how we send out our creatures. Here's the little pelt... <laughs> Peltophilius. What's his special? What's it going to be? Oh, it's another ball! Oh, Jesus, he did a lot! He really did! Does he have a lot of health though? Look at the curve of that shell! Is it going to withstand the impact of a fully evolved endocritherium? Oh, onto his back! He rolled over! Oh god, that's amazing! Did, uh, with Deodocorus, they found a lot of fossils upside down. And the reason behind that is that they used to live in swamps. And a lot of them drowned! They fell in the water and drowned. And when they fell, they fell in belly up! So. So when people found their fossils, they were upside down because they had floated to the surface when they died. Upside down, belly up, and then sank down to the bottom. Which, that's a lovely, amazing bit of information for you guys. Oh, he took it! He took the lead! Oh, I wanted the saber tooth cat to do that, but um... If he earned it, that's fine. That red mark that's on his back is the blood of the Ambladon. He earns it, a bit like Rambo. Sorry, I was going to say Bardock. That's right, Bardock has the red band from Dragon Ball Z. The blood stained of his fellow comrades. Who into the semi-finals. What are we going to do? I want to see the Terror Bird. I do want to see the Terror Bird. Um, there's so many, there's so many of them I want to see. Uh, I want to see Death Panda as well. I want to see Megalania. Um, we'll send out Death Panda first, then Megalania. And if worst comes to worst, uh, macaroni. I'm hoping. Is that good? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Guys. If this was all star, we could be in for some really, really big trouble. Thank God I know their weakness. Rhino is a charge. Time to fight. Oh god, he's bringing his A-game! Come on, Death Panda! Absorb the blow! Are you? Oh no, he's out! Couldn't even take that on! Out comes Megalania to do some damage! Oh, 2000, that's not bad. But against the Lasmotherium, he's just got too much bulk. Look at that tongue flicking in and out, tasting the air. Oh, he's gonna go for another special. At least he's gonna use all these up. Is he gonna survive? Can a Megalania, a gold, survive it? Yes, he can! The huge monitor lizard that prowled, prowled the uh, Australian uh, Badlands. Um, come on, another charge. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna survive. And unfortunately, the Megalania is, is gonna be in some trouble now. Oh, he knew our weakness, he knew it. Now, Macaroni, we've just leveled up. So, um, I'm gonna have to go for block special, block special once I do this. Oh, he doesn't do as much damage! He doesn't do as much damage! Uh, I'm gonna have to go for the block in case he goes for a special. Okay, okay. Not so good. Um, oh god. Okay, we're gonna have to go for a charge. Right, we can't afford to go for any more blocks or specials. This is a real nail biter! We could be out! Oh, he goes for the switch! Thank god we didn't do the block! And we can get off a bite on this guy. Oh, beautiful. Come on, this could be a close one. This really could be. Oh. Oh, God. 
Oh, he's struggling to his legs. Um, I'm really not too sure what we can do here, guys. It's possible it could be over. Oh, I don't think another special is going to be enough. Ah! What's it got? Please go for your special. Waste your special. Please do it. Or else we've lost. There's a chance we've lost. Oh, he's not. He really isn't. Okay, I've just got to go for it. I've just got to go for an average. And hope that he just uses a normal here. Because if I take it out, there's a chance that when his Elasmotherium comes in, he's going to go for the charge straight away. Yes! There we go! That, that's what we needed. We just needed to absorb that final one. That's all we needed. Um, is a bite enough to take it out? I think it might be. Yes, it is! Onto the Elasmosphereum. We go for the block, which we need to use. And then, could this be it? Could this be our victory? This final special. Oh, come on! You can do it! You can do it! Yes, that's it! I'd like to see anybody else pull off a victory like that. That! Macaroni deserved that. Oh. Oh, into the final. That's probably the closest game I've ever, ever played. Um... Ooh, I do not want to do another one like that, so we're going to have to buy back uh, these guys. We're just going to have to do it. Um, right. We're going to use a, the Deodocorus, and then something else. Uh, we'll use the Monkey, and then the Terror Bird, hopefully to end on a high. What's he got? Probably a fully leveled up Indracotherium. That's what I'm guessing. I'm hoping that maybe we can get down to our bird. I want to see what the bird looks like. If not, maybe this Deodocorus can take it out just in one. Oh, that's our weakness. And look at that belly up through the ground. Come on, right yourself. Don't prove those fossil records right. Bite it on the nose. Oh, okay. Samantha may be a tricky customer. That's another one. We can't survive that. Thank God. Come on. Get up. You can do it. Just take out this oversized giraffe. It's like a giraffe on steroids. Bite it. That's it. That's our first hit, actually. Doesn't do too much. Uh, the the big Bigfoot can do a lot, though. Bigfoot can do a lot against it. Come on, Bigfoot. How'd you come? There'll be a drink in it for you. You can have a lager. Have a Stella. Or a, or a Foster's. Just bite it! Oh, he does a lot! He really does a lot to it. It could probably survive another one. It depends what we get hit with. Oh, God! Come on! Get up, you drunken hobo, you! <laughs> I love it. It's got like a little drunk walk to him. Bite it! Oh, he goes for a block. It could be down to the Terror Bird. I'd, like, I'd love to see it special. We haven't seen it yet. Um, but again, thank you guys for all the likes you leave and all the comments. I love, I love the community we've got here. I see so many friendly faces and faces I recognize. Um, like time and time again, you'll watch the video, you'll like it, you'll comment. That, that's what makes this job worth it. Is, is like, I mean, it's, it's amazing playing it, but really, it, it's, it's waking up and just knowing that. It's a good feeling. You, you, it's, I can't explain it. I really can't. So let's see what the special can do. Come on, Kiwi Bird. Ah, oh, trodden and pecked to death. Jesus, that was brutal. Look at him. He's like, I don't care. I'm going to toss my neck back and forth. <laughs> oh, that terror bird would have eaten the ancestors of prehistoric horses. Oh, God. Come on, bird. You can do it. Just one last stretch up. And let's go for the bite. Eat it! Oh, beautiful. Good kiwi bird. He did wonderful. Oh, lovely thumbnail. Oh, these are so amazing. Oh. Just, just fantastic. And that is going to have to wrap up the episode. Take this into gold. So next time, the next video, I can go straight on and do it. So until next time, leave a like. It really helps out this series so much. 
and I'll see you then. Bye-bye!